Hello, Cancer. It's my lady from Malay's Way Terry, and I'm coming to do your weekly reading for the week of July 17th through the 24th, 2017. Cards I'm using today are Oracle of the Mermaid cards by Lucy Cavendish. And I close off with my Miss Cleo cards. I like to read those straight out the book to ensure you get your full message. I want to thank you guys for like, sharing, subscribing, and setting up personal reads with me. If you want a personal reading, just check in the description box below. Email on me and we can set something up. Um, I really appreciate you guys who have already done this. And um, make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. I don't know if I said that, but there you go. All right, what's going on for cancer? Cancer, 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 July 17th through the 24th, 2017. Cancer. Okay, so this could be some of you are pregnant, some of you are wanting to pre be pregnant, or some of you just found something that you really love, care, and cherish, you know? Ooh, okay. So whatever this is, is the secret for now, whatever is going on. Somebody's pregnant. I was trying to avoid it, but somebody is secretly pregnant and they haven't told anybody yet, okay? That's what's going on here. Still makes me feel good. All right, yeah, so, mm, I don't know. I feel like somebody is used to have, somebody had a few miscarriages and that's why they're, they're scared to tell everybody right now. You know, the, the present that hasn't been coming out. You know, I feel like they had a few miscarriages in the past. They don't tell anybody about them. You know, so now they're pregnant again and they're... They don't want to tell anybody. But this one, I think this one... I don't want to say anything. Let me just keep going. Okay. So it's basically saying for you not to say nothing is a wise decision. Because once you do, especially when you're likely to have a miscarriage, you tell people it gets excited, you know, which gets you excited and all that different stuff. If you're used, used to all those different emotions, if you miscarriage already, it makes it easier, you know. So you don't, you don't want to cause that. You don't want all that extra. <sighs> okay. I feel like for some of you, you have told everybody over and over, like, I'm pregnant, I'm pregnant, I'm pregnant, and then it, it lost every time. Yeah, I just felt hopeless. So somebody is feeling hopeless this time. That's why they're not saying anything. They really love their baby. They love their baby, they love their partner. I feel like they haven't even told their partner because they feel like they know what's going to happen already. All right, Cancer, Cancer, Cancer. What's going on for Cancer? July 17th through the 24th, 2017, Cancer. July 17th through the 24th, 2017. Mm. Okay. Sorry, I felt like I had to do the Kelty Cross for this one. <laughs> All right, folks. So first, we got the Two of Cups. Two, 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 two. Two of Cups. All right. And make sure I don't want to read the wrong one. It says, "This is a card of union of two people coming together at a time of understanding between those two people." Then we have the Strength card. All right, the strength card says, now is the time for great strength. However, use 
patience wisely to achieve your goals. You are above your enemies. Do not overreact. Confront any situ bad situation now. So I feel like some of you feel like people are intentionally pissing you off just so you can lose your babies because of jealousy. That's just the feeling I just got from reading that card, okay? So now we got the Five of Cups reversed. All right, information, knowledge of self, history, and a window to correct past behaviors set out to find new goals. Yeah, that's what's going on right now. Um, I feel like... You know that these people are intentionally trying to stress you out and, you know, do this little sneaky stuff so that you can't have a baby. And now you picking up and leaving. You're like, I'm not dealing with y'all no more, you know. All right, so you got the seven of, what is that? Seven of swords. Seven of swords. Oh, if I can find the swords. All right, and it's reverse. Result product of your labor, wisdom, and outside support. So basically, other than your partner, you don't have any outside support. And while you're trying to bring people inside of the, to this relationship, that is what's causing you to have all these miscarriages. Okay? All right, so we got the King of Cups. So... That's why it shows you in the future just dipping out like I'm I'm leaving this. And I I feel like some of you are leaving your partner too cuz your partner some of you partner is in on this, you know. And I feel like some of you left your partner before you even let them know because you knew they were going to talk you try to talk you out of it or piss you off to the point where you lost it. Look at that. That's this. Uh, a dishonest male, deceptive, lack of integrity, not to be trusted. So I feel like you both do love each other in the relationship part of this situation, but you know that this person doesn't want either another kid or a kid, and they keep doing stuff to cause you to lose the baby, you know, just stress-wise. I hope it's just that. Um, and then your friend's jealousy, you know, they put you in these p positions that get you to... Um, lose the baby and right now you like I'm about to dip out and I'll be back when this baby is here you know because you don't want the stress and stuff to cause that but good luck that's all I have for you uh, make sure to check your sun moon and rising signs if you want a person read check in the description box below um, take care of yourself and leave <laughs> have a nice day week